what's up welcome to another episode of third coast fishing today we are going to show you how to clean a redfish if you're new to the channel go ahead and hit that subscribe button give us a thumbs up if you like redfish i know you do everybody does Alright, so the first thing I do is get this bad boy. Get this bad boy. Sharpen. If you don't know how to do this, I'll make another video later. I guess that'd be a good video, huh? Okay, clean it off and try to get all this slime off first. Makes it easier to go with. Always run this way. Don't go up like this. They got gill plates here that will cut you. All these things will mess you up. So always go this way. All right, once you got it all cleaned up from right here to right here, you gotta pop these scales off. You don't pop these you don't have to pop these scales off but if you don't you're just gonna dull your knife the first cut myself in the face okay so now feel here where the meat starts and the bone right here I like to take it from here cut it all the way to right here you feel it right there come up under see these scales Okay. And what you're gonna do is right in between these fin right here. See that? There's a soft spot right there. So I like to take that soft spot here and come all all the way down to right here. So you're basically gonna come to right here. You just you're only putting about that much of the knife into it. about right there is good. I'm gonna do the same thing to the front. Right here. 
and just staying on the top side of them scales. You just take it down and you follow the bone. Go follow that backbone. And pop through and just take it all the way down. All right, so we're gonna spray this off again. Now they got my neighbor out here. Okay, see, so we followed it all the way around the backbone. I'm by far not the best at this. Let's get a look at that from a different view. See that, you just cut right along the backbone. That's that backbone right there. See, all this backbone. You're barely losing any meat on there. And you just cut down to the belly and you follow that backbone right there you, you feel these little knobs right here all right so now you got to break through these one two three four five six there's like six or seven backbone ribs i'm gonna go get a bigger knife all right i got this serrated knife just to cut through those backbone that off and you got your whole fillet you can cut this from here just cut straight down wow you got all your fillet right here Okay, you're gonna try to get it towards the end of your cooler lid or whatever cutting board, whatever you have. You want to put it along the edge like this. Okay, dig down in there a little bit just to get to the skin. Keep your about a 30 degree angle on your knife. Wiggle it back and forth. Just pull at the same time. See that? It's gonna lay that skin down. Cut that fillet right off. Just keep working it back and forth. Flop it over. Get a good bite on it. Wiggle it back and forth. your back bones, your rib bones right here, and just cut right on that. Cut all this belly off right here. I'm going to trim this off. Okay, that's all trash. See, almost nothing wasted. You can cut that off if you want. Um, I don't really do belly meat. Okay, then what you want to do is flatten this out. At that same 30 degree angle, 
you want to cut on the outside of this red line right here basically all the way through it So, give you two little, you're gonna cut all, all this red stuff, man. This is, all this red stuff is nasty. Then you wanna cut, I do two inches of the tail, I take it off. That's where all the mercury's at. Okay, you're gonna take this little bit of red vein here. Take that off. Push that aside. There you go. There you go. That's how you uh, fillet a redfish. It's not the best, and you know, I haven't done it too many times, but you know, it'll work. It will get the family fed. So don't forget, if you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button, give us a thumbs up if you like this video, and we'll see you next time.